A senior U.S. official tells NBC News the four Americans who were taken at gunpoint as they crossed the border from Texas to Mexico did not go there for any criminal purpose. But the government still does not know who is behind the kidnappings. And now the FBI is offering a $50,000 reward for any information. Joining me now is NBC News, NBC News's Morgan Chesky. Um, Morgan, can you explain this story? It just came to light today. Yeah, Katie, an absolutely frightening situation that played out Friday. We do know, according to authorities, that this group of four people had departed Brownsville in South Texas to cross the border into neighboring Matamoras to, uh, according to officials, purchase a medicine there. Of course, being able to do so at, at a far significant price, lesser price than what you can buy those medication uh, with in the U.S. And immediately upon crossing the border, Katie, we're told that they were caught up in this exchange of gunfire between two groups of which are currently not named at this time. Uh, but shortly thereafter, uh, these four individuals were taken at gunpoint and kidnapped. And right now, uh, according to the field office of the FBI in San Antonio, they are working with Mexican authorities to try to track down uh, where these people are, who these people are, uh, and who's responsible for doing this. My colleague Kelly O'Donnell uh, asked the White House press secretary uh, as the latest a short time ago, and here's what they had to say. Take a listen. We are closely following the assault and kidnapping of four U.S. citizens uh, in Mata Morosa, Mexico. Uh, these sorts of attacks are unacceptable. Our thoughts are with the families of these individuals, and we stand ready to provide all appropriate consular assistance. U.S. law enforcement is in touch with Mexican law enforcement. The Departments of State and Homeland Security are also coordinating with Mexican authorities, and we will continue to coordinate uh, with Mexico and push them for, uh, to bring those responsible to justice. Any early indications as to the circumstances or um, any efforts to try to locate these Americans? Don't have anything to share outside of what I just laid out. Clearly, we want to be really careful here. There are privacy concerns. And the FBI now offering $50,000 for any information leading to uh, the culprits or to getting those four individuals back home safe and sound. Authorities say they were last seen in a white minivan with North Carolina plates. That's what they were taken from uh, when they entered this uh, horrific exchange of gunfire. Katie, important to note here that violence had been so bad in Matamoros that the U.S. consulate had issued a travel warning the very day that this took place.